Hello, hello, hello. This is Mike Reed coming to you with a video on XLT conveyor ovens. I've spoken about XLT a couple of times before. Um, I've given some examples on where you find XLT, but I wanted to give you this video, present this to you. It sums up all of what I was saying and it hopefully this will help you understand and help to drive home the point of what i'm trying to tell you as far as the training programs of some of these organizations without further ado i got a little video for you on xlt in this video they're going to explain the training program uh it's only a minute and 27 seconds so they're going to explain that, give you some phone numbers and the whole nine. Here we go. Fair use. I've been working here 13 years since 2010. So I've done quite a few, quite a few things here. This video is on YouTube, by the way. Now I'm back up in tech support where I get to help uh, folks solve their issues over the phone. I enjoy talking to the customers. It's, it really feels good when they call in uh, and they have an issue that you can help them with and fix and resolve that day. And they're up and making pizzas again or whatever they're cooking on their conveyor ovens and they're making money. In turn, that's really gonna turn into uh, them being able to provide for their families, maybe grow, provide for their communities. Thank you. So and see, that's the understanding that the factory has, that these people are using this equipment to make money. Everybody understands that. They're trying to help whoever is working on the equipment. So no matter if it's somebody that's trained or, or actually the, the person that owns a piece of equipment, they'll talk to whoever, find out what's going on with the equipment, and then they'll go, they'll act accordingly. So much for your support for XLT. And we'll I've, actually, you later. I've actually talked to him on the phone. Right? Like I said before, they travel wherever their ovens are, and this goes for the other brands. The trainers are actually going out there and they're taking care of uh, some of these issues. If certain customers buy enough of their equipment, the manufacturer is actually going to go out there and help strengthen their program or help them get people together as far as the to service their equipment. There's your beloved schematic. You have a training board. zero cost let me go back training xlt service training at the where at the factory is zero dollars of course you have to pay to get there you got to pay for your lodging and food but the actual cost of training is zero it is right there you get for the factory floor Hands-on training. That's what you guys want, right? Hands-on training. Troubleshooting, preventative maintenance, and then they teach you how to do the hoods. So there's the number. 316-943-2751. And I have some email addresses, and I have the full address for the facility, the hotel that they recommend that you stay in. It gives you a discount the whole night. Now I want to show you a little something. This video has been out. Let me get rid of this music. This video has been out about about a month. One month. They've only got they've only received come on Diana. They've only received 300 views on that. Now they want to go over the cleaning. The factory website itself only gets 148 views. So, you know, the factories want you to learn this information. They want you trained in this. All right, let me go and flash on over to the factory site because I'm not going to make this a long video. Uh, let's see what time we have here. 
we're at six minutes so let me let me sum this up let me give you this information on the on where their their location is so they're in wichita kansas try to blow this up for you there are the phone numbers so you will book your flight to wichita kansas now they do the train it's a two-day training course he left that part out so it's two days they typically do the two days in the middle of the week like tuesday wednesday um, they don't have any hard schedules. If you call them, they'll try to arrange something. And he told me he does training with all kind of numbers. He, he said he would just do it just one person alone. It all depends on, you know, what the situation is. Uh, but more than likely, he would try to group you with somebody else. They give you all the access to the service manuals. Everything is on their website. So it's xltovens.com. It's a very simple website to get to xltovens.com. Like I said, this is in most of your pizza joints. It does more than pizza. The oven does more than just pizza. Uh, this is Domino's Pizza Oven of Choice. Some of the old locations have um, have other brands, but the new, all the newer ones have this red XLT oven. This is the example of the hood. Both of these pictures have the hood. So he spends time, one day I believe is over the hoods. So one day they explain how to install the hoods, how to wire them up, how to connect them up to the, uh, to the building and the whole nine there. It's a, it's not a very drawn out process, but he does explain how to properly set it up. They have, they, they have all kind of equipment that's specially designed on how to move this stuff around and how to set it up as just a two man crew. So you're not going to need a lot of people. The two man crew is just for safety reasons. Um, so here's one of the smaller XLT ovens. And as you see, you can stack them up to three high. All of them, I believe you can stack them up to three high. Here's the much smaller tabletop one. And other places use these ovens too, as far as cooking um, cookies, that type of thing. You have some cookie chains. They actually started using a conveyor oven just like this. I think they still do. I think that's that's just how they do their cookies. Uh, let's see here. So XLTovens.com. The classes are during the middle of the week. He typically will do it. Uh, he'll do like maybe one or two classes a month. They're really good people to deal with. These ovens are everywhere and used in a wide range of applications. And with that, I want to thank you all for hanging out. But I just wanted you guys to have this information. Have a good day.